What's going on, guys? It's T Games here again, and I'm doing another voiceover for you. Um, Smash Four, and today I wanted to talk about a new move that I did not know at all, and I just did it there. Well, it's called a wave dashing, but in this game they call it perfect pivoting. So, I mean, yeah. So, anyways, so I was at work the other day and this guy was he was arguing about Smash 4 and this and that. You know how it goes. And then he was telling me about wave dashing. And I never knew about that at all. And I felt so retarded when I finally realized that yo, that's actually a move. And that's actually a move people been using for a while. You know? So I start using it. I start practicing, training, and eventually I caught on, you know? And in this game, as you can see, I was using it to try and, you know, as you can see, I did it again there. But right now, I'm getting torn torn apart. Like, this Captain Falcon is really getting to me. But, um, I was still going, ooh, and he got me there. And as you can see, look at that, 3%, and I lost, lost a life, and you only have 3% with two lives. And I still, I guess, you're going to see. You see, this is the point where you just got to keep your calm. Because you never know what could happen in Smash. You just got to keep trying. And as you can see here, many people would have just gave up and probably like, you know. But look at that. Ooh, look at that spike right there. He didn't see that one coming. You see, I took advantage of a little space right there. You see what I'm talking about? And look at that. Now, look at that. Look how fast it has made us almost even. So you just got to... Just got to keep trying, don't give up, keep your calm. As you can see, I kept my calm. He was beating the crap out of me the first part. But now, ooh, okay. You see? And as you can see, the wave dashing technique is really good. And the way to do it is, you got to, like, flick. You got to flick the um the left thumbstick back and forth really quickly. Um, I mean, if you guys want a better tutorial, I could always do that, but... For now, that's all I could give you. I mean, it's really, it's not a hard move to do, but it actually, it's very weird in a way. Especially for me, since it's new. And as you can see, I'm trying to do it there because I had just learned the move. But I was like, hey, this gameplay wasn't, this, this gameplay wasn't too bad. So I said, you know, I'm going to post it. And I see, you know, it was, a, it was a good game. And I, you know, I came back. I didn't give up. And that's the point about it. And, oh, and that's it for him. <laughs> So, as you can see, the wave dashing helped me, definitely. And especially for a slow player like Ike, wave dashing is really, I guess, or as you can say, perfect pivoting, because they say that for for this game. Um, that really helps slow characters like my character, because Ike is a great character, but, you know, his weakness is he's slow. So, I'm glad I actually found something that would help me, and I should have been new about this move, but hey, you know, it is what it is. So, thanks for watching, T Games here, and I hope you liked the video, um, try to learn how to wave dash guys, it's really important, and um, it will really help you out, and I definitely, this definitely has improved my gameplay, <laughs> like a lot, so I'll definitely be using this move, and of course get better at using it and when to use it, anyway guys, that's my, that's my video right there, I hope you guys liked it. Um, you know, leave a comment, like, subscribe, and definitely be be uploading more content in the future. And when I when the Smash Ultimate drop, and I get that Switch, definitely be posting some Ultimate gameplays. So, for now, hope you guys enjoyed this, and I'll be catching y'all later. Bye.